In this video, we will discuss IELTS speaking related and frequently asked questions. Discuss Let's start with the basics. What is the first What is IELTS speaking test? The IELTS speaking test is a discussion of 11 to 14 minutes with a certified and a highly qualified IELTS examiner. This is three sections and record it. Part 1 is a question and answer session, part 2 is a talk and part 3 is a discussion on broader topics or issues. The next question is, what do I need for the speaking test? You must bring the same passport or national identity card you supplied on the IELTS application form and continue to use the same identity documents for each part of the text. Your identity will be checked before you enter the interview room. Moving on to the next question, how will the speaking test be marked? You will be marked on your fluency, vocabulary, grammar and pronunciation. Now let's find answer for another question which is why do I need to expand my answers in speaking test? To get a good band score, you will have to showcase your language proficiency along with fluency. And for achieving this, you will have to expand your answers thereby showing the examiner your willingness to elaborate on the topic. The succeeding question is what happens if you continue to talk over 2 minutes in IELTS speaking part 2? You don't have to worry about it. The examiner will always be controlling the time strictly during your test. If you prolong your session, he or she will definitely stop you and will move on to the part 3 of the speaking test. Another frequently asked question is whether the candidate can choose the topic or change the topic on the cue card provided for the part 2 of the IEL speaking test. Unfortunately, the answer to both these questions is no. The examiner will be giving you a cue card with the topic followed by a list of questions. So you will have to stick on to the topic that has been given to you. So I hope you got clarity regarding your IELTS speaking test. See you soon with another video. Thank you.